Hello Kellys, it's Mary and welcome back to the Kelly Closet. So today's video is going to be on this first attempt at a sleek low bun. So clearly this is a puff and not a bun <laughs> but um, yeah I just wanted to see if I could actually get my hair into a slicked back style that didn't involve a puff at the top of my head I just wanted to see if I could get it to work so this was my first attempt please comment down below and let me know what you think was this a success was it a fail you can let me know um, I'm pretty happy with the results it didn't quite turn out the way I wanted it to but it's going in the direction that I wanted it to go in so as usual if you enjoyed this video then please give it a thumbs up below and hit the red subscribe button if you have not done so already and um, enjoy the rest of the video okay so to begin with I'm gonna show you what I did to prep the style so you can see I've got three hair bands going on and I'm just gonna show you from the back of my head what I did now excuse me for being a little bit too close to the camera but hey it happens so basically I took about half of the hair on my head and put it in one hairband like so and then I took some more of my hair basically another layer of my hair as it were from the front of my head and pulled that going back and then put that in the second hairband and then lastly I took the hair from the very front of my head and smoothed that back as much as I could and then I put that in the last hairband so this is what I did before I went to bed the reason being I just wanted to try to stretch my hair and kind of mold it in the direction that I knew I was going to need it in for the next day and I forgot to mention this was an old twist out so my hair was already stretched but I just used my headscarf to stretch it out some more so now the next day I took my eco styler gel the black castor oil bun and also my spray bottle with water and I'm just sectioning off my hair now I didn't really explain why I sectioned off my hair but I'm just gonna try to explain now so my hair is very very dense and if I just try to put it all into one hairband at once that was not really gonna work for me so yeah my hair just needs to be sectioned off so you can see the hair that I'm I've just basically repeated the same idea with spraying my hair with water and making sure the water's really worked well into my hair and then I add the gel to each section and then put a hairband in each section and just continue from there so here again the idea is exactly the same so I just make sure I spray my hair liberally and I mean liberally a really good amount of water in each section and then I smooth it down with my hands and then I add the gel when that time comes <laughs> and then after adding the gel um, I just put the next section into a hairband so I just had to basically lay my hair down in stages and it went pretty well but as you're gonna see in a bit this was my first attempt which went wrong for reasons that I will explain in a while But safe to say, if your hair is as thick as mine, you're gonna have an arm workout. My arms were just, wow. <laughs> Bruh, my arms. So you can see here that this is the third section and yeah, I'm just doing the same thing. My only issue with this section was that I think that for me, this section was a bit too big. I feel like I should have actually split it into two, that that would have done a better job. But nevertheless, this was my first attempt, so I was just seeing what was going to work and what wasn't going to work. So you can see that I just started to smooth my front hairline down with gel. I was going to pay extra special um, attention to this section of course because it needed to be done. This is the bit that's going to show at the front. So of course I got my ball bristle brush and started to just brush this back and brush it into place before I really put the hairband in. Now you can see the hairband that I took to do this section was actually the really really thick one because clearly this is the one that's supposed to hold the hair as much as possible. Um, but I mean I wasn't completely happy with this I just kept spraying water on it. You can see that there were some sections that were kind of half dry and yeah it needed quite a bit of work to kind of get it to the way that I wanted it to look. 
so now I'm taking yet more gel and smoothing that into my hair some more now here I was a lot more happy with the way that my hair looked but I didn't feel like it was as tight as I wanted it to be so here I'm taking my usual hairband the one that I do puffs with and the idea was that this was supposed to smooth my hair as much as possible but then in order for this to work I had to take the other hairbands out so here I am taking them out one by one but then I realized that my hair at the back was kind of just too free and loose for it to go into the shape I wanted it to so I had to shape, take one of the hairbands back and put it back in yes the struggle okay <laughs> so I was just kind of going with this and seeing what was going to happen but then finally when I did it it was okay but it definitely was not a low bun which is what I was really going for so this was a fail okay so now this is attempt number two I decided to put a hairband in my hair just loosely just to kind of set my hair in a low bun position and then here I go again with my usual hairbands but at this point I'm kind of realizing that this is just like it's it kind of works but then it was way too long like I started to wrap it around my my uh, puff at the back and then I kind of realized like actually hold on this is this is not really working so this is attempt number three now I went in with a shorter um, hairband aka foot of tights slash stockings slash pantyhose and yeah so this was meant to be tighter and smaller than the other one which it is but it was still too long so yeah I kind of just decided to try, try and t tuck it in and tie it around a few times but again still wasn't quite happy um, but I decided to kind of roll with it and see what was going to happen so I sprayed some more water in there and I just keep spraying and keep spraying keep smoothing and keep smoothing even more gel than before but you can see it's kind of starting to take shape at this point like okay this is kind of starting to look all right like we're not too bad now and yeah I'm kind of you can see I'm smiling now so I kind of like it a bit more now now I've decided to try and use my really thick hairband and tie it around to kind of make it tighter and then take the other hairband out which was yeah it was a bit of a struggle but yeah we got there in the end so at this point I was pretty happy with the front what I was not happy about was the section of my hair at the back which was like partially dry and just needed some more water and some more gel like I'd sort of concentrated so much gel at the front that I felt like it wasn't quite working at the back but anyway I corrected that as best as I could off camera but I was pretty happy with it so I decided okay we're gonna put the headscarf on and just leave it for a while um, and just let that set and then take it off and see what the results are. Let's see what happens. Okay, okay. So Curlies, this was the final result. Um, I was very happy with the way that my hair was slicked down at the front. Um, the gel did a really good job. I feel like I wanted the bun to be um, a lot more low than this and I think I wanted it to be uh, a tighter look and grip than this but you can comment below and let me know what you think. Was this a pass or was it a fail? Either way, this just goes to show you that just because you're a YouTuber and you do hair tutorials doesn't mean that your hair turns out perfectly every time. We have hair fails just like everybody else. So if you did enjoy this video, then please give it a thumbs up below. You can also tap the circle on the screen with my face on it if you'd like to subscribe for more videos like these. And here are some choices of some other videos that you can watch. Wishing you health, happiness and beautiful hair. I'll see you soon. Bye.